Part of what makes holiday movies so appealing is the promise of comfort. The genre is known for producing warm and fuzzy feelings, derived from twinkly winter settings and charmingly predictable plotlines. We know what to expect at the end of a romantic comedy about meeting a partner's dysfunctional family at Christmas time. Many viewers have probably been in that exact position themselves. But few experiences are universal, and the new movie, Happiest Season, presents a version of the story that, before this year's crop of LGBTQ holiday fare, was rarely depicted on screen. Directed by Clea Duvall, the Hulu release stars Kristen Stewart as a woman named Abby who accompanies her girlfriend, Harper Mackenzie Davis, to her family home in the Pittsburgh area, only to learn on the way there that Harper hasn't yet come out to her conservative parents. Duvall, who is gay, co-wrote the film with Mary Holland, who plays Jane, one of Harper's sisters, after years of hoping to see more queer Christmas movies come to fruition. There's often an added sense of responsibility to being one of the most prominent, and, happiest season, bears the weight of Harper's struggle to reconcile her actual identity with that of the daughter her parents seem to want. But Duvall points out that humor is also inherent to the film's central debacle, which requires Abby to pose as Harper's straight roommate. I've spent the majority of my Christmases with other people's families, and it's a very specific experience to be dropped into the middle of someone else's family dynamic and to see your partner, who you think you know so well, revert back into this other version of themselves," Duvall continues. As much as there's a very serious side of it, there's also a lot of really awkward comedy that comes out of it. Some of the film's funniest moments come from these uncomfortable situations, as highlighted by a running gag about Abby's dead parents. Neither actress has a background in comedy, but Duvall sensed versatility to their dramatic work. Also confirmed by Stewart's hosting gig on Saturday Night Live, the director adds, where she got to be, free and funny and silly. Stewart, a queer woman, notes that some jokes nearing cliché in her own life, the specific awkwardness of running into your girlfriend's ex-boyfriend, for instance, feel fresh in happiest season, given how rare they are in a commercial comedy like this one. It's so familiar to me that it's like, finally, Stewart says. Duvall and Holland reworked the script as each lead, plus a few supporting acts such as Mary Steenburgen, who plays Harper's image-obsessed mother, came on board. Some of Davis's earlier conversations with Duvall centered on, the politics of being a straight woman taking this part, the actress says.